My name is Phillips uh, with Corella. My business is basically um, Autoflex, Proline, Liquid Wrap. I'm in the Liquid Wrap industry. Got transitioned over to the auto body and collision industry. Liquid Wrap started off in 2011. I basically noticed the potential that it had in the future. And um, it was just something that really triggered and interested me. And I thought there was a future in it. And I basically grabbed it and learned as much as possible from it. The materials evolved, the industry has evolved. It's a very young industry, but there's still so much potential to go with it. And it's just, I, I just saw it as being more practical. Basically, I pretty much started it all on my own. Uh, I was one of the guys in the garage, in my own personal garage, spraying my own car, spraying my own wheels, my emblems, little things like that. And, you know, I realized that it was a business and I could make some money out of it, especially since everyone was interested in it. Yeah, I basically started off in my garage. From there, I um, basically, one of, one of the car washers, one of the guys at the car wash noticed what I was doing. The owner of the car wash saw the difference in the, in the paint of my car and he was asking me what it was and how you do it. And he became in interested. He also saw the potential of the business. And then I partnered up with him. We basically got into the garage together and I started spraying out of the uh, story out of detail garage, car wash. And um, from there it's just evolved and it's grown every year. Decided to go with the liquor wrap. It was because one, it was inexpensive. It was more uh, manageable as far as the material, um, and people were actually interested in it. There was actually a good potential. There was good business. A lot of people saw and loved the way how clean it would peel off without leaving any glue residue on the car. And basically, you know, uh, there was the business out there for it. The goal was there, and I said, hey, you know what? This is probably the best thing to do and I was actually rapping doing vinyl wrapping and just the price range was just a little too high for customers uh, and it was just it was a meeting a lot of people's needs and uh, and I saw the potential in the liquor wrap business and how you can mix your own colors and you know customize the finish uh, whether you want a gloss finish or a sand finish or a matte finish now we even do a frost finish um, and at the end of the day, it's all about flexibility. Actually, yeah, I, I am making a difference um, as far as the Pro Dipper uh, name, that brand goes. It's, it has made a huge impact. We're actually involved with, uh, you know, Fonzie, uh, DipYourCar.com. We're involved with KP Pigments. These are the big distributors and sellers of, of, of the liquor wrap. And not just that, I mean, just doing a three, three, four cars a week uh, pretty much just tells you what kind of difference you're making um, to people that want to just have a nice clean looking car and sometimes you can't afford the vinyl wrap you can't afford a real paint job so going with the liquor wrap it's something that's inexpensive very flexible you get that color that you wanted from the dealer or, or the finish that you wanted um, you know that you probably couldn't afford and now we're actually able to bring that to you at a low cost and uh, more people are doing it so well, this Lambo here, this event door, is actually going to be Autoflex. Um, my first, very first step was getting the color. The custom color that we chose was this guy here. In order for me to achieve this custom color, I had to do days of samples, testing, mixing, uh, just to make sure that the customer was happy with the color that we were actually going with. So this blue to purple shift, it took us a good three to four days just to come up with it and, and make sure that the customer was happy with, with the color. Um, today we actually prepped, I had a crew come in, uh, TNG uh, Auto Spa. Uh, they came in and washed the car, prepped the car, took any uh, wax, any oil off the body of the paint to make sure that I'm able to spray it and there's no oils or contaminants on the body. Now my next step after the wash is Obviously, the masking, the prepping, the removing of the parts. We want to make sure that everything on this car is, sits nice and flush, and the Autoflex looks like it's factory paint. You know, that's that's the goal in every single car that we do. We want to make sure that it looks like it's factory OEM. Um, once it's sprayed, the car is going to get polished and wet sand. Autoflex could be wet sand and polished, which is a great 
um, a great thing about it. You get it as smooth as actual paint, and um, you know it's it's very flexible to do that. Once all that stuff is done, all those steps, obviously there's going to be another wash involved and then clean detail uh, to make sure that the car is pretty clean. But this this is a really big project. It's a huge challenge, uh, and it's just a bigger step in the next direction. Well, I'm going to continue doing liquor wrap until the industry either fades out, which I don't see see it happening. We're only expanding, we're only growing. Uh, the industry is still so young. Um, for myself, um, I love spraying it, I love doing this. The team, it's all about growth. So I'm actually gonna get more people involved with the staff. Um, we're planning to just keep growing with it and take it as far as it could go. Um, you know, and continue with the auto body and the collision as well. The shop itself, it's fairly new. Um, it's, it's, it's all about growth, so we're looking to expand building from there, see how far we can go.